Jackson. At a total of 455 pounds from Texas, Jay Youngblood. His partner from Hartford, Connecticut, Jerry Oski. One fall, 10-minute time limit. Referee Tom Branch. Doggone good opening tag match coming up here. Ought to be a good team of uh, Big Lou and Jerry Bryant together and certainly a couple of very excellent single wrestlers in Oski and Jay Youngblood. So we're starting out with Jerry Oski and Jerry Bryant. Is Bryant having a little trouble uh, seeing with his uh, shades off there, Dave? Yeah, the bright lights, I think, giving Bryant a little bit of trouble. Uh, don't bet on it, boy. Brian, one of those wrestlers that will sneak up behind you and uh, pound you in the back of the head with a fist. Jerry Oski. Young man out of Hartford, Connecticut. Ooh, a nice move. Oski puts Jerry Bryant on the mat. Bryant immediately jumps up and tells referee... I don't know what he told him. He was no, complaining he said about he's something. got some kind of grease on him where <laughs> I couldn't hold on to him. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Old tactic, but it works sometimes. Yeah. You complain enough and you get the referee looking for those mistakes and maybe not paying attention to uh, some of the illegal tactics that you are doing yourself there in Brian's case. Brian with a top wrist lock, he's got a guy that's taller than he is, and that always makes for problems. Double top when we uh, have Brian locked up up there. And Jerry Oski, who outweighs him, has the height advantage, and referee Tom Branch says, let's break it up. Brian fired Oski into the ropes, but Jerry Oski was set coming off of there. Now Oski... Waits, drops it, and puts Bryant down to the mat. Jerry Bryant hits for the corner, tags his bigger partner, Big Lou Winston. Winston is a big guy. He has good height. Over to the corner, Jerry Oski makes the tag, and here comes Jay Youngblood. He's from New Mexico, wrestling out of Texas. Round behind Big Lou Winston, picks it up. Black suplex. Goes after Brian in the corner. Young blood uh, in recent weeks has had quite a problem with Mr. Brian. Brian's involvement in uh, the destruction of a ceremonial address here a few weeks ago. So no love lost between those two. Lou Winston back in the corner. Jerry Oski in after the tag from Jay Youngblood. Two and a half minutes gone. I noted, uh, Dave, when Youngblood was in there, he was casting some looks over at Jerry Bryant like he would like him to get in the ring with him uh, rather than Lou Winston. Drop kick by Oski. Not a great one, but boy, it did the trick. It got, uh, got Lou Winston off his feet. Oski with a headlock back to the corner. The tag's being made. Back in the corner, Lou Winston. Has Jay Youngblood, referee Tom Branch, looking for a break. Look out, Jay Youngblood, after Jerry Bryant. He's got him by the hair. Oski said, let him have it. He does, right fist, and again, Jerry Bryant chopped down to the mat. Bryant on the floor, yelling at the referee. You're gonna let him get away with hitting me with a fist? Bryant, around the ring, back up on the apron now. Jay Youngblood helps him in the ring. Flips him right over that top rope. Youngblood. Drops him to the mat. Jay Youngblood. A uh, knee lift and yeah. broad arm across the back, perfectly timed. It was kind of like a sandwich there. Bryant now feeling the upper arm across the back of the neck. Jerry Oski in. Oski dropping with the upper arm. Come on, Jerry, baby, come on. Come on, Jerry. Mm, what a kick. Bryant pulling hair. 
Jerry Bryan makes the tag. Here's Lou Winston. Four minutes, 35 seconds gone in this action. There's a slam. Oski leaves Lou Winston, hits for the corner, the tag on Jay Youngblood. Youngblood. Picked up by Oski. Now Oski heads back out. Oski was going to help uh, Youngblood power down yeah. on top of him to press. It didn't work. Nice recovery by Jay Youngblood, though, as he takes control himself. Youngblood. Drops down. Two, three. He got it. Five minutes, 26 seconds. Youngblood, Oski, the winner.